welcome Geminis. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful like, shares, and support. Okay, Geminis. <laughs> there is no question about this week, Geminis. <laughs> But you need to share unity, and I know you're going to say why. <laughs> All right, so Gemini, um, um, unity is, um, you know, collaborating and comparing and really working to towards uh, um, the same good traditional viewpoints. The energy of uh, the money is here, Gemini. So congratulations, but um, money will be coming back to you. That is really what is saying because the nine of pentacles is uh, upright and it is in the reverse. So I see in the past you had some sort of regrets with some money, um, but the money is going to be coming back to you. You're going to be um, hearing about this in this week. So however, this is transpiring. So news is going to be coming in. Okay, so um, what we see, you have family issues in this week, some sort of a situation. Some of you Geminis could be turning away from a family. The grandchildren is going to be coming over. I see some sort of a hand is coming in. Um, I don't think some of you Gemini wanted this in, but uh, um, I, I, I see you, you know, you Geminis had to be honest and said, listen, um, I want, I don't, you know, I'm asking for this, but I really don't want it. Um, so some of you Geminis really want to get out uh, um, and I don't think you really wanted to get out, but however, it's strength tired things or what it is. Emotions, you're going to be planning on Monday. On Tuesday, you're going to be taking time off for yourself in order um, to review a situation. On Wednesday, you could be hearing that money could be coming back to you. On Thursday, I see an end is coming into a situation. On Friday, I see you're looking forward to move forward and have a new start. On Saturday, um, a situation with a family and a child, a whole lot of issue with um, the family and the kids. So, and that is only with um, people who have kids, okay? So I see some sort of a good news is going to be coming in on Wednesday. So some of you are going within and trying to figure out a way in order um, to create some sort of a family. I see some of you um, uh, want to know whether or not you should have had a child or um, should have had a child with someone. And I see some of you are regretting having a child with someone. Whatever it was happening and transpired, you regretted having a child with someone. And I see some of you want to end this relationship. You turn your back on this family and you regretted having a child with this person. Um, I, a lot of you are going to be planning um, on Monday to move. Okay, so I see some sort of a uh, planning that you're going to be relocating or buying a new place. Uh, you're definitely planning on moving and relocating. So this is going to be good. So it is emotion, emotional. Monday, Tuesday is um, a very emotional. Wednesday, it's going to pick up. Um, Thursday, you're finding out that an ending is coming in. And Friday, you are looking to create something better. So... You're dealing with the, um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man, and a lot of you are planning, uh, are planning to move forward, whatever is happening and transpiring. Um, it could be your boss, and I see a transition is coming up for this man. Um, um, definitely a transition is coming up for this man, whoever this man is. Uh, and these two people, um, regretted what they have done. So it's as if you, you were connected with, uh, who are these people in the first place? They could be um, your family members or you could be married to them. You could be in a relationship with them. So it's a Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn person and a fire sign person. Um, you realize that you have made it the wrong decision with these people. I see um, you're trying, you know, turn your back on um, the fire sign person um, and realizing that this fire sign person was very deceptive whoever this fire sign person is and whatever that was transpiring was this very deceptive your burdens are going to be over now gemini so wh whoever you are as a gemini um that was in a relationship with a leo person i see you're going to be ending this relationship and getting out of this relationship or this deal or this contract that you had with this leo person i see um this man 
turn your uh, turn their backs to you and it's good it's perfect because uh, you can finally get rid of this person once and for all i see a lot of you your family is going to be helping you out so whatever the situation is if your fam if your father is a taurus virgo or capricorn this man is going to be helping you out i see some sort of a transition in the family a lot of you are going to be finding out that you have a lot of enemies okay um, there's no question about it. You're definitely going to be finding out that you have a lot of enemies, okay? And I see no love is offered to you, but that is okay. Um, from and I see a judgment call is going to be coming up. So, um, this is kind of weird. It's a weird situation. I see a judgment call is coming up on a Leo man, um, because they found out what a Leo man has done. I see some of you, this was what I said, you wish you did not have a child with a person. A lot of you really wish you didn't have a child with a person, whatever is happening and transpiring. I see some of you really wish you didn't have a child with a person, whatever has happened and transpired, you realize uh, um, that um, it was not the right thing to do basically, okay? It was so, it says it was... Uh, um, it was the wrong thing that you have done. I, I see a lot of you regret having a child with a person. And you realize that this person um, was not right for you. However, this is happening and transpiring. You're realizing that this was not the right thing that you should have done. And it's too late. It's too late. And this is it. Um, people always have red flags. And... You just never listen because your friends, your family told you it is not the right person. It's not the right situation, but you never listen. And I see that here is where you have some sort of a red flag. So, so I see a lot of you was dealing with a um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man. Whoever this man is, I see an end is coming in for this man. And I see a judgment call is coming on this man because this man has created a whole lot of burdens uh, for you, Gemini. So whoever this man is, uh, um, whether it's your husband, a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person, or a boss, whoever this person is, an end is coming in for this person because they have created so much issues uh, for you in your life. And I see truths are coming out. There is definitely going to be some sort of a transition in the family. If some of you are in a relationship with a cancer, I see that you're going to be realizing that this person and their father or this person and a whole person have created a whole lot of issues and obstacles for you. And you are going to be realizing that um, it is what it is, but you need to change this um, frequency in your life. You're not really dealing with this. So a lot of you, if your father is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorns, you have some regret. regret. Your father could have uh, used your information and create a whole lot of issues for you. And I see you regret this. On Tuesday, emotional situation where you're stepping back and going within. A lot of you are dealing with a Leo and a Sagittarius man or woman. And I see a transition is coming up to these people. Whatever these people have done, people are finding out the truth of how these people have collaborated and created some sort of a problem um, for you and your family, whoever these people are. And this man or woman is 45 years or older, but it's coming up as a man, 45 years and older. It is a Sagittarian and a Leo. And I see you're stepping back and looking at the lay of the land. And it is better for you to do that at this moment. I see the Sagittarian man have turned um, his back on you. And now you're finding out that it's because of uh, jealousy. Um, jealousy, a whole lot of jealousy, a whole lot of secrecy with a whole lot of money. And I see truths is going to be coming out. Now, then um, we see the energy of the um, 10, um, the 9 of Pentacles. And I see as uh, some of you are going to be happy um, that you receive the money as return. But I see you have a whole lot of enemy. It's as if... Um, someone had extort you a whole lot of money and the money is returned, but everyone is eating on you. It's okay. Fine. No problem. But you have your money. So let it go. Let it go. Take your money and move on. And it's coming up um, for 
um, a group of businessmen that uh, so criminally work against you. Oh, an end is coming up. Oh my God, an end is really coming up to some sort of a criminal um, work that was created against some of you. And I see an end is really coming up with three businessmen who have created some real criminal offense against you. And they're ending their contract or they're ending, um, you know, their business because of what they have done. Secret. Some of you had some sort of a secret love and it's going to be coming out. So whoever was having some sort of a secret relationship, a judgment call is coming out. The family is going to be finding out about this on the weekend. Um, so we have a secrecy and a lot of you have enemies and secrecy and you're turning your back and leaving this play behind and looking forward to a better future and a better surrounding and a better future. Whatever is happening and transpiring, I see truth is going to be coming out and you're looking for a better future moving forward and this is going to be good. So however it is happening and transpiring, I see happiness and joy is going to be happening and transpiring and I see truth is going to be coming out. A whole lot of you who were having secret affairs, secret relationship, um, and had a child outside. I see this is going to be coming out in this week. So be aware of this because it is really going to be coming out. I think that it is time because the child, you were trying to keep it, um, on the rocks for a very long time. But I see that because of the coronavirus, a lot of people's secrets are coming out. So, a lot of people's secrets are coming out because of the coronavirus. So, be aware of that. So, work together in order to let people protect your secret. Because I see your secrets will be coming out, especially in this coronavirus. Transition coming up for a family. I see no love is offered to a family, but it's okay. Um, let it go. Um, I see a Leo man and a Leo man and a Taurus man. Um, is a Leo man and a Taurus man. Um, I end is coming in for them. Um, so whether this person is your partner, partner or your business partner or, um, your father or your husband, a Leo and a Taurus Virgo Capricorn man, um, is definitely in some serious uh, issue. They were your greatest client. And I see judgment call is coming down on them and their family. So transition is going to be coming up and it's okay. Um, it is going to be a positive transition because whoever the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man is and was that uh, created some lies and deceptiveness. I see truth is going to be coming out and they're going to be finding out. Um, uh, they have found out what these people have done. I see a whole lot of money is going to be coming, um, back to a whole lot of you Gemini's or money could be coming in, um, pay out, uh, unexpected money back pay that sort of a thing could be coming in for a lot of you gemini's and i see the energy of the moon and the destructiveness uh, that uh, secrecy of course a lot of you gemini so gemini's it is um it is bad because of some sort of a secrecy um it's going to be costing a lot of you gemini's a whole lot of uh, money or situation because of some sort of a secrecy that some of you Gemini had a hold it's going to cost you unity um um some of you money is going to be returning to you and because of this money that is returning to you um there is a lot of jealousy but it's okay you know take your money and yeah you don't have to be friends with these people um if these people are upset with you now that it's their problem not your loss um, most of you Gemini's your burdens is going to be over but I see a lot of you have issues with your kids issues that you had a relationship or had a child with someone that you know you should not have done and now you're really regretting it and you're really thinking if only I had listened and sometimes it is good because sometimes people from outside the relationship is seeing the truth about the relationship and you 
and sometimes you just think that people don't want you to move forward nay it's because they see the deceptiveness of other people and you can't see it because you are so in love with them you only see love okay so i gotta go namaste please remember to thumbs up like and share these videos go back and listen to the third week to see who this person is what the situation is remember I love you, Geminis. Oh my God. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Geminis. You have been rocking this channel. Um, it has been a powerful year for you, Geminis. And I so love you guys because no matter what happens, you still get over this and you can see, um, that this frequency of this year was giving a lot of you a whole lot of money because money always keep on coming up in your reading. Um, for business people, you can go check out the business channel to see what is coming up. And I'm saying never stay until next time.